Wow, look at that damage. This goes to show you that you don't need a tornado to knock down a lot of trees. That was a microburst yesterday. 70 mile per hour wind in Westport. How about this view from the top of Church Street right now? Get out of the way. It is a really, really cool scene. You can see the light shining through just a sign of how dry the air is here close to the ground. So yes, the rain is coming in now, but a little bit of a struggle and it is still falling apart. 74 at the airport in Burlington. Dew point down to 52. We've got the radar here with the showers in the Champlain Valley now. A little bit left behind out towards Tupper Lake and Saranac Lake, but that'll also fall apart as well. So the closer look shows some pretty intense rain leaving Altona right now. Uh, slightly lighter rain for Champlain. Beekman Town in on it as well. But notice how it's really collapsing in terms of how much real estate it's covering compared to just an hour ago. There's the fair, Essex Junction. So a couple of drops now, a little bit of a steadier rain in 10 minutes. I'd say it lasts for maybe 20 minutes and then it is out of here and we're not seeing lightning with this part of the rain over the Burlington area or anywhere in Chittenden County right now. Couple of strikes still west of Saranac Lake. That's what the trailing cell behind it. But again, that one will weaken as well. And this is really what it is, another push of dry air. So it's already less humid now, but tomorrow even drier and we're not expecting rain. No lingering showers tomorrow. Hey, temp down to 57 in Saranac Lake. Notice it's still about 77 in Lebanon, so warmer east where the showers have not made it yet. We've got the live lab data where the radar here showing where the lab is just north of the five corners. Temperature about 75, not much of a gusty wind right now either. So the few lingering showers are diminishing and it turns cooler tomorrow. Highs in the 60s before a warm up for Friday and for Saturday. We're down to 55 right now at the base of Whiteface. Water temp in Lake Champlain holding at 75. So that means tomorrow the water will be warmer than the air for just about all of us everywhere as we go through the day for Thursday. It's 72 still at the Knapp State Airport in Montpelier. So here's future cast clouds mixing with sunshine tomorrow. Highs in the 60s and then for Friday it feels like summer again with sunshine and blue sky. So on the lake tomorrow, yes, it is chilly with that wind out of the north and west. But again, the humidity is staying away here for not just the next few days, but also Labor Day weekend. So there's the sunshine Friday, 80, 85 on Saturday. And then the second half of the long weekend looks a lot cooler, 60s and low 70s. Look at next week though, a stunner with sunshine and temperatures in the 80s. So with the rain on the way in, we send NBC5's Ben Frechette out in the weather lab to see what things are doing out there. He stepped away from the lab briefly to pet the pups, and there he is right now.